Hey everyone, my name is Jason the Blessed Beardsman and I'm so thankful that you stopped by to take a look at this video and uh, to check out my channel. Uh, I have a great beard product review for you tonight. Very excited about this one. I've really enjoyed the products that the kind folks at this company sent me. And we're going to talk about Weather Beard Supply Company. You're not going to want to miss this review, so stay tuned. <music> Before I start my review, let me invite you to hit that subscribe button down below. Also hit that notification bell so you can be one of the first to see the new videos as they come out. Also leave me a comment or a question can be about this video or anything else beard related down in the comment section and I'll be sure to get back to you as quickly as I can. Weather Beard Supply Company is a company based out of a city in Ohio. If I try to pronounce this city, I will totally botch it. So. Let's just say it's based out of a city in Ohio. And it was started in November of 2015 by a husband and wife duo, uh, Corey and Hannah. And when I heard their story about how they started, I thought it was a really neat story. Corey and Hannah use essential oils in their home uh, for different cleaning purposes and medicinal purposes, just like my wife and I do in our home. And what Corey found is that a lot of the industry, the essential oil industry, is geared for women and is uh, produced and manufactured uh, for women, which I found to be true too. So he started researching, are there any products out there in the essential oil industry for men? And he found the um, beard care industry. So as he was doing his research, um, he started finding these different beard care uh, products and so forth and he decided that he was going to make some of his own products just for his personal use. Well he did that, his wife really enjoyed them. She had a business herself so she said why don't you promote your products uh, and, and try to sell your products. They did and the rest is history. Now they have this great uh, company and it's building and growing and they have absolutely phenomenal products. A couple of the staples of their business. First of all, they use high quality and cold pressed organic carrier oils. They use 100% pure essential oils in all of their products. And in some of them, they use bath and body safe fragrance oils. Uh, and they use organic shea butter and beeswax in their balms and whips. What that tells me is their ingredients are quality ingredients. Their products, therefore, are quality, high quality products. And I loved them and you really loved them, and you're really gonna love them. Um, Corey and, and Hannah were so kind to send me three different products to try out and review. So thank you so much, uh, Corey and Hannah, for doing that. I really appreciate your generosity and kindness to me in sending me these products. I thoroughly enjoyed them and um, I know that anybody else that, that buys the products will thoroughly enjoy them as well. So I just wanted to stop and say thank you to you uh, for your kindness towards me and sending me these products. Now, they sent me three different things to try out, so we're gonna dive right into the three different uh, products that they sent me. The first they sent me was one ounce of their beard oil. Now, in their oil and their whips and their balms, they have seven different scents that they use. And uh, so this is the Tree Beard Beard Oil. I'll show it to you there. It comes in a one ounce dark amber bottle. Forgive me for the camera shaking. My dog keeps laying right under the table where I'm doing the review. Uh, but anyway, uh, dark amber glass bottle with an eyedropper top and very nice simple label. On the, on the back, part of the back side of the label, there are some steps on how to use uh, the oil, some directions. Also has the ingredients listed, which is very helpful, very nice. Carrier oil, sweet almond oil, grapeseed oil, castor oil, and avocado oil. I'm beginning to see the avocado oil used more and more in these companies in their products, and um, that's uh, beneficial to the skin and the hair. And uh, I love the castor oil. 
uh, in there as well. Their essential oils are pine, cedarwood, sandalwood, tea tree, and lavender. If you've watched any, any of my other videos, you know that I really enjoy the tea tree scent. It's probably my favorite um, essential oil out there is tea tree, and I really enjoy when that's in a particular product, and this one did not disappoint. Uh, if you watched my last video, I did my top five beard oils. I almost included an honorable mention uh, section where I put a couple in there, and this would have been one of those honorable mentions. I really enjoy the scent. Let me show you uh, the color and the consistency. The color is a very light oil, almost a clear oil, has a little bit tint of, a, of yellow in there, and it's a lighter oil. Kind of surprised me that because it has castor oil that it was so light, but and there's nothing wrong with that. It wasn't, that's not a negative. I'm just telling you the consistency is a little bit lighter of the beard oil. The scent will last a good part of the day. Beard oil will keep your uh, beard feeling soft and moisturized and conditioned, and it's a very good product. This one ounce bottle of beard oil on their website will run $15.95. So definitely a good price for the one ounce beard oil. The next thing they sent me was a two ounce uh, tin of their beard balm. Just like the oil come in seven different scents, they sent me a different scent in their beard balm and that was the Sweet Ember scent. And this runs for the two ounce $18.95 on their website. So I'll show you what that looks like. It's a metal tin, very nice label on the front. Uh, on the top of the tin. Now, this is not your typical screw off. It's a pull off, but that pull off is really easy to get off. I do not typically like the pull off tops because they're hard to get off. This one from the second that I got it, it just opened really, really easy. Um, on the inside of the tin, it has the ingredients, which we'll get to in a second. Let me show you the color and consistency. It's a, a, um, a lighter yellow in color. And it's a very soft balm. Um, you don't need a lot of force to get out. It will just kind of scrape right out and onto your finger. It melts very quickly in your hand um, so that you can put it really easily into your beard. Now, the ingredients to this balm are shea butter, beeswax, sweet almond oil, grapeseed oil, castor oil, and avocado oil. And there's some fragrance oils added in. And for this one, you get fragrance er, uh, oils that are herbal and floral uh, from the tobacco leaf flower, along with a blend of vanilla and spicy cinnamon. Now, I can kind of get the floral and the herbal, but what this really smells like to me is a cinnamon candle that you would burn um, in the fall. Maybe a like a baked apple type cinnamon, like a baked apple pie cinnamony type scent. And I love it. I really enjoy the scent a lot. Um, man, it's so good. And it's a really nice balm. It's a medium hold. So it'll take care of the flyaways and that sort of thing. So you definitely need to check that out. It's Sweet Embers. That is um, $18.95 on their website for a two ounce tin of beard balm. And I really enjoyed that beard balm. It's what I have in my beard right now. Then they sent me a two ounce uh, plastic container of their beard whip. That's what it looks like. Nice label on the top. And on the back has their ingredients and so forth on the back. Um, this is basically a beard butter. Uh, so you have the balm which uh, can controls the beard and gives a little bit of styling and hold. If you don't want that, you can go with a beard whip, which is basically a conditioner. Now, this is definitely a whipped uh, product. You can see the consistency there, but it's a harder uh, consistency. It's almost like they whipped it and then it hardened a little bit. Nothing wrong with that. Again, that's not a negative, just trying to tell you what the consistency is of it. And, but as soon as you uh, pull it out, it emulsifies and melts incredibly fast, very easy to apply into the beard. Uh, just like the balm and the oil, uh, there are seven cents to this, uh, to, to, to their whips. It runs you on their website, $17.49 for a two ounce. You can also buy a four ounce for $31.95. And the one that they sent me was Amber Trail. 
Now, Amber Trail, uh, what's nice about, again, their whip is the ingredients are right on the back. Shea butter, shea butter, mango butter, sweet almond oil, grapeseed oil, castor oil, avocado oil, and then the fragrance oils. The fragrances are an amber and sandalwood mix with base notes reminiscent of a cream soda. Now, I don't really, I'm not really familiar with the cream soda. I've had it a couple times, but what this smells to me is a very light, fluffy, uh, fresh woodsy type scent you definitely get the amber and the sandalwood the woodsy um and it's just a very clean fresh scent I, I like this as well it's probably my least favorite of the three but i like it it's not again being the least favorite of the three isn't a negative thing it's a very nice scent i would probably say the the uh tree beard is my number one favorite then the Sweet Embers is a very close second, and then the um, Amber Trail would be my third favorite out of the three if I had to put them in an order. So those are the three things that they sent me. I highly recommend their products. I can tell that they use high quality products, uh, ingredients in their products, and you're going to love their products. So you can find them at weatherbeardsupplycompany.com. I will put all their information down in the description box below. So thank you for checking out my channel. I'd like to, again, remind you to subscribe. And we're, I'm going to be doing a giveaway um, once I hit 100 subscribers. So I already have some of the products that I'm going to be doing my uh, giveaway with. Uh, they already came in the mail today. And I'm very excited to show you what those are once I get to 100. So make sure that you are subscribed. Hit that notification bell so you can be one of the first to see the new videos as they come out. If you like this video, give me a big thumbs up for it. And also leave me any comments or questions down in the comment section below. And I'll get back with you as quickly as I can. There goes my dog knocking the camera again. Sorry about that. But uh, for now, that's all that I have for you. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you have a great night and a great week. Stay blessed. Stay bearded. Bye-bye.